Hello, everybody. We're back with more Fable 2. I'm really happy. Um, so, I would have streamed yesterday, and I was streaming yesterday, but I ended up cutting my stream short because nobody was showing up. Yeah, the after Christmas party, massive fucking bust. Nobody... <laughs> Oh my god, nobody fucking showed up at all. Uh, I think about, actually no, I think three people, well four people showed up, one of whom wasn't invited, one of whom was not invited and also permanently earned their sale of a spot in the fucking block list on my uh, VR chat lists, whatever fucking Christ, I'm my brain is not fucking working today. But yeah, they they've earned a permanent spot in my block list and completely ruined their friendship with me in pretty much an instant because they decided to be a massive cunt. They decided to invite a bunch of their fucking simp's in, and then when I told them to, hey, I've known you since you were sixteen. Stop making sex noises. They, one of their simps started fucking picking a fight with me. And then they started picking a fight with me. So I was just like, you know what? I'm not going to deal with this. And I changed the instance to a friends only, or no, an invite only instance. And uh, I removed them. Because they pissed me off. But anyway, back to the game. That's really not that important. I should have some money now. Yeah. Because every five minutes, even when you're not playing this game, you're, uh, you earn money from your, like, properties and stuff. Alright, where is it? Run! It's not popping up. Ah, oh, there it is. 1900. 1980. That is nice. Yeah, I forgot. Sometimes it takes a minute. Alright, let's do some quests. But yeah, that person is no longer my friend. I haven't seen them in forever, and the first thing they do when I fucking see them is just act like a total asshole. So fuck them. Tentable shadows till death do us part. The archaeologist. Right. I'm going to do this next. And I am actually going to marry Alex. And yes, I do know what happens later in the game to whoever you marry. There, There is actually a narrative point for why I'm doing that. Sorry. I ran into a child. As such, I am going to be getting my home back and I'm going to put my wife here when that happens but any and casual animal abuse but anyway what I was saying yeah that person's been removed and one of the, the other person who hadn't been invited but joined anyway uh, we are now closer friends because they turned out to be really fucking cool. Uh, Noonie, if you ever see this, love you, hon. You're a great friend. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Well, I get 50 gold every five minutes. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna slice you open! Right. 
got no melee weapons. Which, honestly, I'm tired of this challenge. So, here's what the challenge is going to be from now on. No progression beyond iron weapons. I... Unless they are iron weapons with augment slots. And additionally, I will be using the iron cleaver. You just mighty person. Also, I am no longer going to not be using melee because this game's just it, it, it's just tedious. It's not a challenge, it's just tedious. Like doing less damage, that's a good challenge, because it means you have to actually like be a little tactical. So, yeah. I will be getting an iron cleaver and a iron either turret rifle or turret pistol or clockwork pistol. Or I think it's a wheel lock. I'm sorry. I don't remember. Oh, I get a ruby. Oh, that means I can unlock the other five key chest. Hee <laughs> hee. But yeah, the, the, the whole fucking, like, ranged weapons and will only thing, that's that's just going to stop being a challenge after a while. It's just going to continuously get more and more tedious. So iron weapons only, and only cleavers, and non-flintlock pistols. Because that means I do less damage. Ow, you bitch, don't stab my dog. But that, that, my dog. Fucking nose is fucking plugged up. Yeah, this is way more entertaining. Oh, and I can upgrade my physique now. Now watch as my muscles grow. Though it kind of just barely shows until you're like level fucking three in physique. Though I do think this looks good because, you know, now I'm not scrawny and I actually have some muscle showing. Dude, get your fucking rifle calibrated. You should not have shot the ground there. Ah, my nose. So long, so lost, so, so angry. I need to find peace. I need to find justice. Maybe you can help me. You have no idea what I've suffered. The pain that still keeps me in this world. I was going to get married, you know, to Alex, the prettiest girl in town. We spent so long planning the wedding, picking out the flowers, choosing the food, the music, the words we'd speak, and then the big day came, and... and she didn't show up. Please, you're the only one who can bring me justice. I want her to feel what I felt that day, the pain, the humiliation, I want her heart to shatter in so many pieces, she can't go on living. Mm. 
Will you help me? Yes. Excellent. It won't be easy, though. You'll have to make her fall in love with you utterly and completely. Then, when she's ready to accept your proposal, when she can't imagine her life without you, give her this. I've spent a long time thinking of the exact right wording. And even longer getting it onto paper. Well, I am incorporeal, after all. Which makes it all the more impressive that I managed to get this, too. In case you need the help, I well, know I did. That is a book that I am going to read right now. I need to go over these. I need to get more of these books. Oh yeah, when it inevitably happens, I am, uh, I know exactly what I'm going to do, you know, when that happens after I've gotten married. You know, that thing that you have to wait till marriage to do, because not doing so is a sin. And you'll, I don't know, get, your fucking dick will turn into a fucking slug, I guess. I don't know, whatever goofy stuff. Bible study told you it would happen. Yes, I see it. And I believe this is like 500 gold. Money bags. I need to get a different shirt. I wish there was, like, more basic outfits in this game, because just about the closest thing to a basic outfit in this game is the popper outfit, but wearing that makes everybody think that you're a bum. A thousand thanks. I don't do this very often, but you really deserve a special discount. Yeah, because, like, five stars, three stars. This is the three-star shirt. Not exactly, you know, a basic-looking shirt. I do like the, uh, the carriage driver gloves. In fact, I might just get these. I hope it brings you great happiness. I don't really like the bandit shirt because very I think it nice kind of just looks goofy. Wow, you Thank you very great. much. My children speak of all the great adventures. Yeah, I'm trust. aware. Probably so because I'm not be a well-known adventurer. That. Flintlock, shirt rifle, fuck. This guy's only got the flintlock stuff. Bitch. The best selling item to wear on the shop. Hello. Well, hello there. Hey, it's Sparrow. How can I help you today? Uh, here we go. Barrow Stone Market. My nose itches.
God damn, how long did it take me to get here? I must meet with you boys. After anything in particular? Sweet cleaver. Ah, you fat bitch. I'm after the iron cleaver. And the iron wheel lock pistol. And I think the... What's his name? Fucking... The merchant over here. I think he sells... Iron weapons occasionally. Or weapons in general. Where the fuck is he? What the hell? Bower stones. That's stupid. That guy's stupid. It's a shame I don't want to show someone you care. You can't go wrong with our range of gifts. Oh, I didn't see you there. Isn't it amazing? All these people, they look so happy, don't they? I'm sorry. Don't mind me. My name's Alex. I'm... I'm sure you're a really nice person, but I'm not really much of a talker these days. Great. Did you see that fellow juggling knives the other day? Oh, I hear they didn't manage to find his third finger. Freshly picked flowers, seduce, play dead. <laughs> Follow. Okay, lead the way. A refreshing beverage for you? Nicely done. Anything you can help with? I'm pretty sure the jeweler does do sometimes then? sell flowers. Right, let's get rid of that. And that. If you have anything else to sell, you know where to find me. Yep, there we go. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, you because I don't feel like that. sitting here forever trying to get a bunch of freaking just basically doing expressions this over and over again. Place in the world. Right. Let's see. I'm gonna give her a bunch of gifts. First, a ruby. Oh That's God! Lovely. Stalls are no closing. And now, freshly picked flowers. Are you because going those to are lovely. Time for all I hope stalls. So. I'm just the luckiest woman in the world. I never thought I'd find happiness again. I never thought I'd deserve it. I there's something I've never told you. I almost got married once before. He was a sweet boy, but we were both so young, too young. I got scared and ran away the day of the wedding. I hurt him so badly. He he took his own life. I've carried that guilt with me all these years, never dreaming I could love again until I met you. I'm going to destroy the rejection note and marry Alex because I'm a good guy and also uh dramatic irony or something, My I don't friends know. keep asking me why I haven't got an engagement ring. Gift. Take this ring. This is the place for it. Yes, yes. Of course I'll marry you. Alright. And since she is following me. Regions, Bower Lake. The gypsy we camp. Find some place to live if we're gonna get hitched. I haven't fucking heard somebody use the term hitched in so fucking long. Yep, we are going over here. Yep. Also, marrying Alex is honestly the best option because she will literally be satisfied no matter where you house her as long as you, like, have the income, the family upkeep set to, like, 
more than five gold. Within every lifetime, there are moments of greatness, even perfection, some solitary, but others shared. On a sunny morning, under a clear sky, the villagers crowded together to witness two people stand and declare their love for each other. Some say they were a strange couple, others that they saw a story of true love. Only time would tell. I just know we're going to be so happy together. Oh yeah, you get a hundred points of good just for marrying. You've done it. Almost everyone in Oakfield has heard of you. Now you can go back to the abbot. Alright, but first I need to go back and turn this quest in. Oh yeah, you get reputation for getting married too. That's convenient. So they literally put in two fucking quests just so that you could get enough rep for completing this. Or for uh, completing them. What am I supposed to tell his wife and kids? That he fucked with the wrong guy. Here we go. That XP, damn it. Ow! Bastards. Ow, bastard. Ow, bastard. Die, bitch! Oh my god, I love this game's combat system. Like, it's so basic, but it's so fun. Oh, this is my jam. <laughs> sounds like... The fucking... This audio bug sounds... Let's listen. Sounds like the fucking opening to, like, some fucking hardcore fucking rock song or some shit. Oh, I was gonna... I fucked his ass up. Come on. I know there's a little bit more. Gimme, gimme. No, not that. Come on, I know it's there. I can smell it. Fucking five miles under the map, Jesus Christ. Okay, I give up. Oh, I thought I saw a water uh, thingy. 
What is my... Already? <laughs> so, you fell in love with her, did you? The strange thing is, I'm not mad anymore. I feel at peace. I asked you to do such a terrible thing. I'm just glad you knew better. I never thought of how much she'd suffered already. Treat her well, will you? Or I'll be back to haunt you. Alright, before I go to fucking Oakvale. Oh yeah, by the way, this message will pop up until your wife or until you get pregnant and have a kid. Yeah, fun fact. <laughs> so, uh, if you like go out and buy every rubber in the game, you can literally just have endless snoo snoo time. And... You, you gotta, like, wait a day between each, um, session, though, because, uh, you know, that's how that works. Alright, let's go have some fun <laughs> and get banned on Twitch in the process. Minus 25, because my wife takes money from me every few minutes. I'm gonna... Buy something real quick. Ah! Ran into a child. How's he going to... The forest. I am rent out. Stop. Adjust rent. The living corpse. You put on those trousers by mistake. The hero traveled along a wild but Hey, Alex. Oh, she's upset. You'll see. No one can catch me. Oh, this was so thoughtful of catch me. Thanks. I just gotta wait for her to do the thing. The village was surprisingly Are you just too you lazy to me. buy some proper clothes? Oh, you're back. Where have you been this time? Time to run. Well, I've been Who knows? gone Thanks. for like Maybe five minutes. Day we'll get married. We are married, dumbass. We should spend more time together. Stop hitting on me in front of my wife. She's just standing there menacingly. We don't do anything fun anymore. I've heard there's a bit of a sale on near Oh, here. this is going to be great. I'm going to play music for my wife. Ah, I fucked up. Keep practicing. How did I end up with someone so good looking? Alright, let's try again. Not fuck up. Gotta let go at just the right time. <laughs> That's just smashing. Too many yeah, speaking of smashing, didn't you want something? Wow, never seen a beard like that before. Oh, we a How have you not? This is the fucking. Okay, look. All right, I'm gonna go to sleep. And also up my daily upkeep because All right, what's the budget? Twenty five. I'm gonna set it to fifty, which is most of the money I make, but this is more just to keep her happy. Cause that's like twice her required up. No, that's like five times her desired daily upkeep, so she's never going to be unhappy. 
the home is not great, so I'm probably going to move her somewhere else. So I don't have to fucking come back every five minutes just to keep her happy. Oh, I got a gift. Wow, fuck you. You know what would make me even happier? If everyone thought you were as good looking as I do. It might take some work, though. Who fuck does you. your hair? Looks great. Let's rest for another six hours and hope that the fucking what's-his-name is up and actually at his store. Where's the fucking merchant for this place? What'd you say? You're smashing. You're looking well. Are you going to be really romantic? I hope so. There, Max. Now you're at you're Max just affection. A peach, a lovely sweet peach. Pretty mm, fine. Nice. Love those gloves. I think I saw your wife the other day. Is she that tall, lass? Hmm. Maybe I'm thinking of someone else. I don't know. She looks taller than you. Soylent die. Okay, now who owns this shop? Because I'm really getting sick of waiting on him. Okay, uh, yeah, okay. I own the shop. Where is the damn merchant at? cute little sparrow. This plan he did execute to perfection. The journey lasted several weeks. And one night, the inevitable happened. A violent okay. storm broke There's the out, tattooist. tossing the ship as if it were nothing more than a floater, and eventually <laughs> mashing its hull into splinters. Perilous hung on to what seemed to be a piece of mast, but was actually a peg leg, and drifted to the shore. Oh, stop it! You're so naughty! <laughs> and they said marrying a hero was a mistake. <laughs> What do they know? May I be of assistance? You'll be there we go. That... You're always welcome in my store. Give me a shirt that isn't fucked up. Hold on. Oh yeah, there's a bandana here as well. Alright, this it's doesn't really provide anything. Real bargain. What about this? No. I love how the fucking head wrap is counted as cross-dressing, even though it's, like, You're the most basic fucking piece of clothing ever. And the leather boots, that makes even less sense. Anyway. Ah! You bought a fine item! Enjoy! Yeah, shit. Take this. Always happy to buy your unwanted items. Don't great, worry, you'll see. Can't believe I'm God, I look terrible. Please come again. But that removed the last of the clothing that makes me less attractive. And that was really my goal. And I probably could have done it a lot sooner by just buying one of the pieces of clothing that I didn't want. No, I have to be difficult. I'm also going to change the fucking color of this shirt. I only have this crappy green dye, but I just want to get rid of the damn... Oh, that looks terrible. I'm not going to use that. Something or other. Perilous arrival at the foot of a range of mountains. And had no choice but to climb its treacherous Okay, uh, Alex is being difficult. Though I think I know how to fix that. <clears throat> Oof. I just popped my neck.
easiest way to fix that, come to the bookstore and... Oh my god. The bookseller is not here. Where the fuck is he? It's 4 p.m. Why the fuck is the book Why the hell is the book vendor not in the damn bookstore? How are you doing? I'm at your service. Oh boy, meat trader has a gift. Pomegranate dye. Esther Fowerstone, right here. Personally, what I think is one of the worst looking dies in the game. I'm coming over here because there is dye in the water. It's not a good die, but it's there. Shit. I don't think there's anything else down here. You'd think this dock would have more than just that dive spot. The shops are now closing. Yeah, gargoyle trove right here. Which you can actually see the uh, it's closing time for all shops. You can actually see the lid for the gargoyle trove in Fable Three. Oh, another dive spot. We're not speaking. Guaranteed to polish your smile to the purest white. Not recommended for anyone with chalk allergies. Money. Fucking, I, I was saying something and my brain stopped again. My brain's just not working today. Where's my dog? Where's that little shit at? Get your ass up here. I know there's a dig spot over here. Nice children. No. Thought there was a dig spot over here. Oh my god. Yeah, by the way, that's never gonna go away. It's broken. Always the only way to get rid of that you. bar up there is to either turn I tutorials on. You want my advice? Actually, no, I don't even think that works. I think it's literally just you have to leave the area, then come back. It's an annoying bug that's been in this game forever. That's for friggin' 12 hours. I can gamble using a bag of carrots, can I? A, a bag of what? Whoa. Steve the Traveler. Have you seen that? Can I have my dessert now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. That aroma is very familiar. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I have to do in order to get that gift from him. Shit my pants repeatedly. And you can't actually shit your pants in this game if you fail the... T <laughs> if you... <f> <laughs> if you fail that interaction. It's 8 a.m. Why the fuck won't these idiots open? Mm -hmm. 
the shops are open. Why is the bookstore still closed? You're my favorite customer. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Kiss ass. Does nobody fucking own the damn bookstore or something? Martin the shopkeeper. Where the fuck is Martin the shopkeeper? The shops are now opening! Just now. My very In spite of the fact customer. that everybody's shops have if been open. Bring any... I'm sure I can sell that again. Get your purses ready! The shops are open life. for business! There's Greg the Alchemist. Where's this motherfucker at? When I'm older, I want to be a princess. Or a hero. Yeah, good luck with that. The Alchemist is trashed. God, how does this fucking town have a functioning economy? Nobody goes to work on time. Hi there. Are you a stranger? I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. No, Crate carrier. Oh my god. Me. Some of the shops are starting to run low on stock. Oh boy, what shops? Clothing stall sale in Oakfield. The weapon stall shortage in Oakfield. The furniture sale, whatever, and the stone cutter. Always <laughs> nice to see someone tying the knot. <laughs> You'll be famous one day. Don't worry. You'll this is the too. biggest problem with this game. Just the amount of people who just don't shut the fuck up. Titles, titles, get your titles. Dude, the fucking stores opened an hour ago, an hour and a half ago. And you idiots, stop talking with children. Just now, the alchemist is just now getting to his shop. Speaking of which. Back if you have anything and the book trader say. is still not at his shop. He's nowhere to be fucking seen. Just oh, there he is. You book oh, now. Glad to have you back. Always happy. Do you have a? Someone will be able to use that. I hope he has the right fucking interaction book. New business. Abo is dead. Uh, introduction to navigation, and, uh, Perv's handbook, true hunting, dogs of war, dog tricks. He doesn't have it. He has the let's have sex book, but he doesn't have the... Hang on. Let me just look this up. Logbook. Expressions. Hang on. Personality. Christmas. Okay. That is a expression that you have to have a higher renown to do. Never mind. I'm dumb. Right, what does my wife want? Probably still wants sex. And she's unhappy. Great. We're gonna have to fucking start getting a bunch of money. This is why I always wait till like late game to get married. God damn it, woman, what do you want? How are you? You're it. Okay, she's not that unhappy. Do I have anything good? I 
I'm so happy. I feel like oh, dancing. Oh, you're so Not sweet, me, dear. No one can catch me. Ah. Who's Look, excited, cute, little sparrow? Of course not. But still, it'd be nice if yours were a bit better. All right, well, I'm going to visit you later. I got to go fucking do the ritual. Is it hot in it? Is it hot in here or is it just you? Fucking weirdo. I've spent most of this time doing absolutely nothing of value. <laughs> this is just how I play the game. Okay, I fuck around most of the time. <clears throat> it's you. I prayed for your return. I heard what you did in Rookridge. I think you could be of great use to us. Come, walk with me a while. Now, nourishing the golden acorn is done with holy water from the well spring of light. But the spring is located in a nearby cave, Having which is broken. said to be quite dangerous. Our sacred text says two monks must enter this cave, the strongest and a second of the abbot's choosing. Obviously, this concerns me, especially since the strongest monk here is my own child. So instead of a second monk, I have chosen to send a protector for the first. And that's you, if you're interested. Which, as it turns out, is a bad idea. The cave is just at the end of this road. Look at that! You probably passed it on your way here. Our strongest monk will be waiting for you when you're ready. Now then. I must gather the others and prepare for the blessing. Our first hero awaits us, even if they do not yet realize it. All right, before we do that, items, miss, no, books and documents, the pilgrim. The pilgrim. This hero has great spirit and awesome strength, but it is not yet unleashed. The pilgrim's path is to the north. Items. Just apply that there. Because the bright yellow is not a good look. The mage. the mage follows where wisdom leads, but always into conflict. Making an ally of this hero will cost you much. The thief. This hero harbors a soul without a glimmer of light. I see choked weeds and water. He lies just out of reach. The relic, an ancient device of incredible power, created by those who foresaw the terror of the spire. It waits for one with the strength to bear it, and for the three who can summon it. The choice. A terrible decision waits in your future, and just beyond it, a glorious reward. Yeah, yeah, there's beetles nearby. Put 
Swim the sirens of oak vale out to the seas. Fucking simp. You're doing very well for Down yourself, by aren't you? The reeds. Dude, she's not Down gonna have sex with you. <laughs> Float the souls left unbroken by white balverines. Down by the reeds. Night blooming weeds embrace those who go dancing in sad moonlit dreams. Life is simpler if you Ah, I knew my lovely singing voice would bring the crowds. So you're my escort then? My father said you'd be coming by. Hey there, boy. Hello. Oh, you're a strong, handsome fellow, aren't you? I feel better having you with me in that cave. Yes, I will. I'm Sister Hannah. Some people call me Hammer when they think they're being clever. They're not. But I can't do much about it because monks make a solemn vow never to bash anyone's face in. Did my father mention that? Yeah. Whatever fighting's to be done in there, it's all yours. We require a hero, not a pacifist monk. We'll need her to find a reason to fight. I don't mind telling you, I'm a bit envious. You get all the excitement and I get to carry this bloody thing like some sort of mule. I mean, look at it. It's enormous. Golden or not, how much water does a bloody acorn need? After you. Yeah. Switch over to fireball. It's amazing when you think about it. No one else has been in here for maybe a hundred years. Well, no monks anyway. I guess an adventurer or two could have come in, but if they got out alive, I didn't hear about it. Hmm. Anyway. Hey, don't you wander off now, boy. Look up there. They're lovely. I think they're called wisps. Souls of the dead who never left this world. It's actually rather sad, isn't it? Yep. You are a quiet one. Well, yeah, I got shot in the throat when I was a kid. That's always been my headcanon for why the main character is so quiet. Is they got shot in the neck when they were a Watch kid. Watch your step, doggy. Looks a bit steep here. Do you reckon we'll run into anything nasty in here? I mean, a dark, creepy cave is a hell of a place for a holy spring. Especially for an order of pacifists. You know, I've heard of monks in the north who believe that to transcend violence, you have to understand it first. All right, this should be the central chamber. Wow, I've never seen anything like this, ever. Now, according to my father, we need to go through these three doors in order to collect the water. Putting weight on the pressure plates will open the doors. This one's the first. There you go. All right, so the plates require more and more weight as we go. Luckily, I've got something unbelievably heavy right here. All we have to do is add a bit of water from the fountain that's in the room up ahead. Or at least it should be in the room up ahead. It's deep in here as well. <coughs> this cave really is quite dangerous. 
Not that I've been in many caves. Bet you have, though, haven't you? Probably found all sorts of interesting things. Treasure and that. What do you reckon's down there? In the dark, at the bottom? Bodies, maybe. Bones. All the poor buggers who've taken a bad step. Now, there are two plates in this room. It'll take both of us to get the water flowing. I stand here so I can catch it. And you need to stand on that one. Yep, I'm standing. Right, there it goes. Oh yeah. I can feel this thing getting even heavier. That's nice, that is. So far, this isn't too bad. A couple of steep bits, but that's it. I really hope they find someone else to do this next time. Mind you, I'll be an old lady by then, so I'm probably off the hook. You know, this is probably going to be the highlight of my life. The day I carried a jug through a cave. Hardly epic poem stuff, is it? Did you hear something? No. Probably just my imagination. I actually did hear something. Don't talk much, do you? Right, I reckon that's all the water we're going to get from this one. And here comes... Undead, I mean hollow men. Fuck! No, I'm just kidding. Uh, this is so when I was a kid, I was actually kind of scared of these guys. And then I actually did this mission. This is where you come in, right? And they're really easy to kill. They, did that. they must be trying to protect the water. Bloody hell! That was that. awesome. Unfortunately, I don't think XP falls through the floor in here. No, it looks like it does. I'm dumb. Hurry up. That was fantastic. Those things didn't stand a chance. Have you ever fought them before? Sure looked like you had. That or you're a very fast learner. I don't see any wisps now. And no hollow men followed us. Guess we're safe in here. Mm. Next. All right, second door, second plate. I'm glad I have you along with me. But what if you weren't here? But what if you weren't here? 
Right. Here's the next one. I'll stand by the fountain to catch the water, same as before. Ah, oh, brilliant. Just have to wait until this thing stops running. You'd think they would have made this jug with a flat bottom in case you want to have a rest. But as it is, it would just tip over, and then where would you be? Oh, bugger, here they come! Wow, that must have been painful. If they can feel pain. Oh, that was really impressive! Yes. I can aim. Which it looks really goofy in this room. Because you actually won't look down sights if you aim in this room. I enough ammo to keep doing that. Ha! Keep this up and we'll be through here in no time. Wow, I've never seen someone do that before. Now that I can aim. Full. Back to the central chamber then. I just want to get out of this place alive. We only need one room left to go. So we're nearly finished. Oh yeah, naming I. Get off the point where the gun falls out from under your feet. Be cautious. Two more of those and he'll be dead again. Okay, that line right there, that place. Okay, I should be sitting down. <laughs> That line right there, I've heard that play a hundred fucking times, but, like, apparently that's not supposed to play or something? I don't know. What in the world was that? Are you ready for whatever that was? <coughs> the audio bugged out. Uh, you were supposed to hear, like, a loud crash. on the other side you think he's all right okay i'm getting worried now yeah he's all right all right let's see if i can do it what you got there for attacking him who's a good boy who tears their heads off hollow men is it you is it you boy quite a companion you've got remind me not to let him lick me again I know you can pick this thing up right so we've got one more pick this to head up and then we before. should be don't get too far ahead though I don't know what made that noise, and I'm not keen to find out. Well, sometimes you can pick the head up. Stand directly next to me. Oh, well, remind me not to make you angry. Nice shot. What would my father say if he could see us? These suckers make good. 
good target, huh? So yeah, aiming increases damage. That was great. Killed it with one blow. That was three. These buggers just don't care what you throw at them, do they? Assuming they can learn. Ow! Ouch, Faster. I'm a boss. If I did, this would probably be a lot easier. God damn it. Focus. The Headless oh Hollow Man. You can get us out here, can't you? Which, by the way, one of the easiest bosses in the game. He just continues to attack in whatever direction you attack him from last. Wow, that was amazing! You killed a lot of them! Phew. I was really worried for a moment there. Well, for several moments. I... <coughs> Thank you. You were brilliant. On we go, then. This is it. This is the final room. Should be nearly done now. I know I said that before, but hopefully this time it's true. I think that's the last plate over there. Lords of Light, bless this water, that with it we may give rise to new life once more. As new life rises, so shall we. Sister Hannah. Brother Robin? What is it? It's your father. One of Lucian's men. He's holding him hostage at the temple. He's got a gun. I have to save my father. <sighs> Come on. We have to get to the temple. One of Lucian's agents has come to the temple. Go after her. Oh yeah, treasure. Just break the narrative here for a second. For a shitty ring. What would a soldier want with our temple? Father, are you?
you okay? Also, your character can't one move faster than this. You're coming with me, or he dies. Like hell I am. You let him go before I break you in half. No! Don't make me kill you, too. Oh! I'm sorry, Father. Not that I broke my vow. I'm sorry I didn't break it sooner. I never did fit in at this place. We both knew that. And now I'm making a new vow. Lucian would die for what he did to you. I won't break this one. Sister Hannah, the blessing. You do it. As new life rises, so shall we. As the seed returns to the earth, so do we all. Is that it then? My father's gone. The golden oak is flourishing again. So now life just goes on as before, does it? The other monks may believe that, but your eyes have been opened. Where did you come from? Oh, fuck. Who are you? I forgot to change. Someone who can tell you much about Lucian. Where he is, what his plans are, and how you can gain your revenge, if you will listen. I want to know everything. Then come with me, Sister Hannah. Call me Hammer. Yeah, I forgot to change the thing. I'm really quiet. Uh, it's because I walked away from my mic. <laughs> no, I forgot to fucking, uh, I forgot to change the name of the damn stream. And also the game. I always fucking forget to do that. Let me just... stream info <laughs> I knew I was forgetting something god damn it but now the, the the VR chat Christmas party was a complete bust I ended up like only streaming about 20 minutes and then like nobody showed up so I fucking stopped I've taken hammer to the guild you've done well hero you have gathered the first of the three heroes and we are one step closer to defeating Lucian's plans. It will take some time for Hammer to overcome her grief, and longer to explain her role in Lucian's downfall. Perhaps this would be a good time to upgrade your equipment. I believe there is a sale in Bowerstone. It may well be worth a visit. Come back to the guild when you are ready. I uh, will do that. I am also probably going to just down... I'm going to keep streaming, and I'm probably going to end up downloading the stream and editing out some of the fluff, because I spent, like, fucking 40 minutes scrolling around. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Nobody... I forgot that, like, none of my friends get on VR chat until, like, way late at night. I started the fucking Christmas party at, like, 9...
Is there anything over here? No, there is not anything over here. Skirt! Let's check up on my wife, make sure she's not pissed off. She wants some snoo snoo, but that's it. Every time I try to show up, she fucking doesn't do anything. I'm going to continue to do side quests. <coughs> it was your fault. You're the one who found it. You're the one who read the words. It's your fault. You're the one who said I was a chicken because I wouldn't read it in the first place. <laughs> yes, but you're the one who... Hey, look. You have to help us. He, he raised, raised the, dead. the dead. From the Normie Nomicon. Mother will kill oh, us if she finds you. out. You see, we read aloud from this book we found called the Normanomicon. You're the one who found it, remember? Yeah, and you're the one who read. The thing oh, is, never mind. we sort of the thing is, accidentally summoned a few hollow men. A few hundred. And now they have the book. Only because you dropped it, you big girl. You need to clear the graveyard so we can get the book back and put them all back where they came from. Yep. Where do you think they came from? I don't know. You summoned them. Next time you want us to explore graveyards, hit yourself with a mallet instead. And next time you want to read a book, hit yourself with a giant axe instead. You're just mad because you can't read ancient languages. Oh, yes. I wish I could make lots of corpses who want to eat me up here whenever I wanted. I knew it. Always so jealous. Yeah, by the way, these two are named Sam and Max. Just a little tidbit. Also, before I do this quest, I have to take a piss. I'll be right back. One second pause. I have returned. Hello. Hello. Right. First group of hollow men is... Yeah, yeah, I know. It's a fucking thing over here. Can't dig it up until the fucking hollow men are dead. Fortunately, level 2 force push can pretty much kill any hollow men instantly. Except for, like, the super strong ones. Those don't start showing up until, like, Wraith Marsh. Yep. 
and the introductory the introductory cutscene for them is broken as fuck. Yeah, yeah, I know the highwayman mask is here, and also the hat, I believe. Which, if that is here, I'm going to equip it because I like that hat. Yes. No. I look like a pirate. You should be yeah, I'll be over there in a minute. What's in here? Will potion. Level two inferno. Where the hell did he get to? Welcome to this region. Move it. Die, bitch. Die, bitch. Die, bitch. Ow. I like how all the enemies have the exact same pound, pound, pain sound effects. Like, I think even NPCs or like villagers have the same pain sound effects. Panic when I have my pistol out. I hear the wedding was just lovely. Now, now, enough of that. Enough of what? Saving your ass? Oh my god, I'm almost dead. Ow! God damn it. Wait a minute. Where did the outlaw go? He died because he was made out of bones. Not very smart, are they? Die, bitch. Next level in Brutal Styles, which I believe is Flourish, which is a really good skill. Yes. That means I can do this. I 
I love how just friggin' flamboyant the movement is when you use flourish. Hmm. Oh. Key. Golden key chest. Or not golden key. Uh, silver key. Another shit. What the fuck did somebody lock a mood ring into a chest for? A silver key chest for? That's so dumb. Yeah, worst part about this quest is the fucking guards will still get mad at you for swinging your weapon around. A little bit of an oversight. Neighbors are arguing, I think. Come on, give me that piece of XP that's underneath the floor. Wonderful. I know there's more. You can't hide it from me forever, game. I'm not waiting on this anymore. Alright, what abilities do I have that I can afford? Time control, no. Blades, no. Vortex. So, you want some shooting tips, do you? Try keeping your eyes open, you dark git. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this is a thing now. Where is he? I know he's here. Dad, don't try my patience, sonny. Shut up. I'm hungry. The guy fucking slowly lumbering back to work. I'm gonna immediately come back to this demon door in a minute. Because it's one of the easiest, if not the easiest, demon door to unlock in this game. Oh. Oh. Right. What page was the undo spell on? Uh... Oh, here we are. Tanjir Barada Kanda. Muck look! What? <laughs> yeah. Alright, 250 renown. Plus three because that guard saw me show the tro trophy off. Alright, I'm gonna go back to Alex here in a minute. Just to make sure she's, you know, not getting too pissed off at me. Also, I need to get a better house. It's going to be a minute before I can afford that, though. You please meet so hungry. I was mad long time ago. Ate meat, lots of meat. Then 
of Demon Door. No more meat, only hungry. Please, feed meat now. Pretty easy. All you have to do is go over to these chickens and just very carefully. keep that will be my first demon door use these potions now I can get shock Level two. And I'm going to go back to my wife because the game keeps telling me to go to her. Also, I need to buy more caravans to increase my upkeep. Or to increase my income, not my upkeep. Really Can I afford this now? Yourself. I cannot. Yes? Can I help you? The world is a big place. The for old city people. of. I strike thee down with my mighty sword. If I am rent out, just rent. Down just a little bit. Hello. Gifts. That's a shitty ring. Uh, what do I want to give her? Here. Oh, you're so sweet, dear. Oh, this is going to be great. Sword not hurting as much as you'd like. Yes, yeah. Get an today. Hi, Sparrow. Loved by enough people to be known as Dumpling. Now the title is free. Keep practicing. Oh, let's see. Right. And quick way to get your affection oh, nice. up with Alex because this is her favorite expression oh wonderful sweetheart everything's wonderful excuse me I love what you've done with yourself I hope I can help you today friend always happy to buy your unwanted items uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sell this just because it's be close. Uh, traveling merchant. What? You are now good enough to use the apologize expression. Oh, neat. So much. Don't spend so long alone next time. Neat. I can't remember its name. Buy and rent up. Just rent. I am renting these Your properties, rent right? The He's soon chance. Does anyone sell augments round here? Yeah, I do. We're owned by a real adventurer. So it's your lucky day. Day. Why do we have to There's keep living like ten as a sailor? I mean, have you seen our furniture? 
We don't have furniture. We were live in a caravan because I'm trying to... Woman, I am buying every home. Oh my god, there are so many people talking at once. Look, just shut up about our house. I'll get us a real house soon enough. I think it's about time to. Oh, I think it's about time to start fucking raiding this place. Because there's like gold everywhere. Or like, I know where most of the like treasure spots are. Ow! I can get speed now. Hey, what are you doing with all them weapons? You might as well use a wee to Aye. On. I know there's more beneath the floor. There is a treasure chest over here somewhere. Also bandits. You're not a bandit, you're a beetle. You're trying to make me look like a liar, you little shit. Oh, and a silver key I forgot about. Yes, yes, I see the silver key. I don't see... Thought there was a dive spot over here, but I guess I'm not remembering that right. Health potion in this chest. Ah. Yeah, I know where like most of the treasure is in this place. I thought you could jump off at this point. Guess I'm not remembering that right. Seems to be doing me pretty well. <laughs> My dog is fucking everybody up today. Come on. I know there's a little more. Come on. How the fuck did it get all the way over there? <laughs> Hero, you got any 
Yeah, yeah, I know where you two are, where you are too, bitch. Yeah. That's a uh, a little bit of a weird combination of items. This is where I can find the treasure hunting book three at. How did I miss? Eh. It's always that one dig spot specifically. Oh, that's now it's treasure hunting book one. I could have swore that was a different book. My dog upgraded his treasure hunting skills and he didn't even notice the freaking chest that was right in front of him. But we'll be going to Brightwood soon enough. Go into the lake next because there's like, th I think, two dive spots and also a treasure chest that you can't get to unless you go into the lake. I think there's one of two. That, I believe, is a, either gold, a gem, or... Oh, it's a potion of life. I sometimes forget those are in this game. I also forgot there were hobs over here. Yeah. Ow! Bitch slap. No running away. Insatiable Butcher Pink Dye. Why are there just two fucking treasure spots for that? Wait, what the fuck? That wasn't there earlier. A Civil Ring. I don't remember this dive spot being here. I remember there being a dive spot. I don't remember that one, though. Whee! Here we go. The Rusty Cutlass. Is there another one over here? Yeah, I see it. No, that's a rock. Uh, 
I think there's maybe like one or two treasure chests left. I don't think there's... Ow. I don't believe there's any around Thag's camp that I haven't already gotten. Rabbit's having a stroke. That door just sort of remains locked until the time skip. Ow. Check over here. Where's that goddamn dog at? Coda! Always fucking wanders off. Little shit. Come on. With as often as I'm attacking in front of guards, I'm ex I'm kind of surprised that I've not been hearing a bunch of now, now, enough of that. Because normally, when you know you attack in front of the guards, you'll f just hear that nonstop. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? I didn't hear you. <laughs> Ow! It's so nice of you to save all your gold for ah, You might as well draw a target on your... Who said anything about think? Because as we know, thinking is not my specialty. Knowing, on the other hand, well, I, I I don't mean to brag, but some people call me a, what, what was it? A filthy fucking know-it-all. <laughs> right, I think I've looted this entire fucking place. Except up here. I think there's like one thing up here, maybe? 
possibly. I don't remember. Oh, there's a cave. I vaguely remember this cave. I don't think there's anything else, though. Oh no, Hobbs. Anyone else want to get close, huh? I love how some of the Hobbs just fucking wear ghillie suits. Ow. Well, with that out of the way. I think there's like an amethyst in this cave or something. Yeah, okay, I remember this cave. There's an amethyst in this chest. Okay, no, there's not. My god, it's been forever since I played this game. <laughs> Fuck you, Archer. <laughs> Grr. Eh. I got stuck on a tree. Yeah, yeah, there's bandits over here. Drinks are on me tonight, lads. Let's kill this. Sweet mom. You calling a hob? I don't appreciate you not getting knocked down when I hit you with force push. Kaboom. Come on. No. Okay. Anyway, Blade's level two. Now I can use four knives. Sorry, what was that? I couldn't hear you over the sound of you getting a knife through the head. Ow. Ow. Die, bitch. Come on. 
One, two, three. Just a little more. No, it's it's just gonna be a bitch. It's Call it a what? Call it a what? Call it a you getting your head cut off? Cause that's what I call it. Bitch. Come on. Uh, give me that XP, bitch. Oh my god, I'm not gonna just wait around every time. This gets obnoxious. Normally I wouldn't care, but I'm live streaming, so. That's the cave I've already searched. I don't think there's a chest around here, so. Uh, 5,500 gold. Right, how is my wife? She's all right. Will. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and call this a stream. I think I'm probably going to go ahead and upload this to YouTube and then like maybe edit it in post to cut some of the fluff out. But uh, yeah, that's Fable 2. Uh, probably in about, actually what time is it? It's 10, 19. I think in a few minutes, what I'll probably do is just immediately go to the Bowerstone Blacksmith and just work on getting my blacksmithing all the way up. Uh, I think I'll go ahead and fucking record that just for shits and giggles. But before then, I'm going to eat and Friday I will continue this. But until then, bye bye.